Hi, Marty from Waukesha Floral and Greenhouse, and today we're in the greenhouse to talk a little bit about fall foliage that'll add a little fall color to your homes. A um, couple plants here I just want to show you. This one is a beautiful plant. It's called Stromanthe Triostar, and the neat thing about it is it's a variegated plant that has a burgundy fall color underside of the leaf. Very easy plant to maintain. As you can see, it has a very nice symmetrical look from the top. Um, uh, just a medium light kind of plant, so it's not a real hard one to maintain and it will stay beautiful for years. Probably our most popular fall colored plant is going to be something in the Croton family. Now Crotons need a little bit higher light, okay? So this one is gonna be one that's gonna like a south window, a west exposure, something like that. Comes in a bunch of different forms. As you can see, we have a lot of different color in here. Um, this one is a Bravo, so it has the larger leaves that you see here. And as you see, they go from yellows and they go through shades of red. And this one is a Petra, and Petra has the smaller leaves, but look at the beautiful fall color that's on here. Now, to maintain the color on a Croton, uh, as I mentioned, you need, the, you need the sunshine. If you go into a darker area with it, you can still maintain this plant, but it's going to become darker. It's going to lose some of those bright yellows and reds and become darker green into burgundy. So the more light you give it, the more you're going to see on it. This one is called a, a gold dust. Again, it is just a, another form of that croton, but it's in a yellow form. Another beautiful fall color. Over here we have a, a larger plant. Um, this is called Dracaena limelight. A uh, nice plant because it just adds that really pop of chartreuse that's really popular right now. A nice bright color that you can mix in with your falls. And then we do have a collection of bromeliads down here on the bench. And bromeliads are a very easy plant because um, they don't take a whole lot of care. Bromeliads are nice because the way you water them is you pour water down into the cup of the plant, and there's a little bit of water in this one, as you can see. Um, you just, that's the only way you have to water it. They're an epiphyte, which means they grow in the crotch of a tree in like the rainforest, and um, they would collect their own water by dew running into the, the plant. Um, nice fall colors, yellows, burgundies, um, some bronzy orange colors. Um, just a, a really beautiful plant that's going to last you for a good 12 to 16 weeks in color. So just a little fall primer for you. I hope you enjoyed our trip to the greenhouse today. Waukesha Floral and Greenhouse. Fresh, fun, fabulous.